An exciting night in store. A warm welcome. We're here at the Coliseum, Alfonso Perez. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And really looking forward to starting this new year with some live football for you. It's Getafe facing Barcelona. Well, let's just hope the players weren't at the same Hogney party as you, Derek. Otherwise, we could be in for a really lacklustre performance. But this actually has the makings of being a really good encounter. The initial 11 then for Hetafe. Well, this looks to be a really defensive lineup. They've certainly not come here to dominate possession. But if they defend with urgency, they're going to be difficult to break down, that's for sure. And here's the starting 11 for Barcelona. Marc-André Ter Stegen stands between the posts. Frenkie de Jong plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And leading the line today, Robert Lewandowski. And so the battle commences. Advantage Barcelona. De Jong. It's with Gundogan. Lewandowski. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And it's a quality pass. Well, sadly, too straight to worry the goalkeeper that time. Using his strength to shield the ball. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Undeniably, one of the great finishers of his generation, Robert Lewandowski. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him in this match? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-twos around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He could be the key to unlocking this defence. That was perfectly timed, and it is going to be a corner. Trying to pick out a teammate. They've got it now, what can they do? Pedri. De Jong. Pedri. Gabi. How can they open up the defence here? And making headway. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer, and you have to say it was on the cards. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space, and it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. One nil it is. Let's see what happens next. Not a poor touch and unable to keep it in play. Throw in to come. Good work to regain possession.
Frankie de Jong. Lewandowski. It's with Gundogan. Return to Lewandowski. Getting the better of his opponent. Well, able to close down the shot. Dembele. Will it be? It's gone in. Well, they're really in the mood here. Can they be stopped? Well, let's see it again, because the delivery is absolutely perfect. Hard and low, just inviting someone to run onto it. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Frankie de Jong. Gundogan. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Is it going to be? A goal it is, and a typical Robert Lewandowski finish. Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect. And Lewandowski wasn't going to miss that. He knows exactly where to be when the ball is played in the box. He's such a great player. with the action and I don't think it's overstating things to say that Barcelona appear to be out of sight Pedri Dembele and Dembele is giving it away This attack looks highly promising. A concession of a corner here. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And clearing it away. Barcelona, free kick. It'll be here. Well, no surprise there. Barcelona have enjoyed most of the possession and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Perfect challenge. And foul it is then. Gundogan. Tempele. It's with Gundogan. And Getafe recovering possession well. Wonderfully weighted pass. Tostegan was never under pressure. We've had the official word, there will be a minimum of two added minutes. Very quick thinking there. Alenia. Well, there it is, the half-time whistle, and that will do it for the first half here at the Coliseum Alfonso Perez.
An analysis of Robert Lewandowski's performance up to this point leads us to very positive reviews, you've got to say, Stuart. Well, the keeper will be sick at the sight of him. He's been shooting from everywhere and he's taken his goals really well. And away they go again. The pendulum having already swung Barcelona's way. Let's see how the second half pans out. Good visualisation and execution. Oh, so close to opening up the defence. De Jong. And blocked for now. Porto. He takes aim and nicely parried away. And behind it's gone for a corner. Delivering it, and the corner far too close to the goalkeeper. Frankie de Jong. Well, the perfect tackle, really, and now a throw-in. Lewandowski. Onto De Jong. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Dembele takes on the shot. And the keeper more than equal to it. to go short Gundogan now with Lewandowski oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack and the counter looks on here options available and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end Dembele And it's Barcelona's turn now. Luis Milla. And teammates around him. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. De Jong and given away by Barca Alenia Porto well, this could pose problems for the defenders a wonderful intervention Massa And the cross fired over, but no real central pressure applied. But he keeps going. Well, it came to nothing in the end. 15 minutes left for play. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Pedri 
Gabby. Marcos Alonso. Pedri. Determined defending. De Jong. Gabby. Back to Lewandowski. Is this the moment? Oh, a stellar piece of defending. This might be ideal for the counter. Can they keep it going? Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. And played the pass well. Tempele. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Massa. Now with Porto. A glorious chance. Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. You're absolutely right, Derek. While the result is poor, the display was even worse. They never got to grips with the opposition. They were second best in every facet of the game. They need to do a lot of improving before the next time out. Well, we never tire of watching Robert Lewandowski when he excels, and he certainly did in this game. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.